Now, the third member in the so-called Tennessee Three is Representative Gloria Johnson. She barely escaped an expulsion vote just by one single vote. My colleague Chris Davis was in the chamber when this happened, and Chris, I couldn't believe this myself when you told me, but who was that deciding vote? Well, Jason, it was Representative Justin Pearson. Now consider this. If Gloria Johnson had not gone second in the batting order, had gone third, Pearson might have already been expelled, which would have let Johnson just one vote short. What is my crime? In a way, it was fitting that Representative Gloria Johnson's attempted expulsion came during the part of the session called unfinished business. They believe what they did was right, and we have no guarantee whatsoever that they're not going to do it again. Because the Knoxville Democrat didn't leave much unsaid. I have to raise the voice of the people in my district. And I did what I felt those folks wanted me to do. Last Thursday, during the moment in question, Johnson had a backseat role in the protest that took place in the middle of a House floor session. I fought for my constituents in a quiet, non-desk pounding, non whatever the word, whatever it said about holding up signs or whatever. But I came here and I stood because I did it for the kids in my district. Maybe it was that fact. All those in favor vote aye when the bell rings. Those opposed vote no. But when the votes were counted, Representative Johnson dodged expulsion by just one vote. House Resolution 64 fails. <laughs> We did what we needed to do, and I can't, I can't feel good, too good. Afterwards, Representative Johnson had another theory for why she survived and others didn't. You, I will answer your question. It might have to do with the color of our skin. But true to form, she told demonstrators they still had unfinished business. I hope every one of you will do everything you can to help make sure he comes back here. Now, shortly after that vote, News Channel 5 spoke to Speaker Sexton about it. He says he admits that he wanted Representative Gloria Johnson kicked out of the legislature, but that's just not how the votes went, and he respected his colleague's decision.